so that's okay like I, I totally understand um not being qualified for some affiliates um it's not really like it matters either way but if i can secure something a brand that i like i have no problem doing so so bodybuilding.com is one of my favorite places tons of articles tons of materials tons of uh deals honestly that they have a lot of very good deals for uh gold standard whey protein and uh they have a lot of uh creatine again gold standard a lot of all that good stuff that's been well, my go-to place for work. like so long maybe but i mean old cocktail was built that, to last so it um should start all right that's then. all i wanted to so say about that though so i'm proud to be affiliated with them which was pretty cool uh but with that being said let's start this mission up and see how far we can get tonight it's just about seven o'clock a little bit sooner than that uh if my buddy is not having trouble or if he is having trouble with wow he might be hopping on with us too so that would be cool um and we'll go from there so from my understanding this game is only about nine nine hours long for the story, okay, which is nice. Um, left the fabricator in here. I just realized that Thursday works. night, 9 p.m., uh, if you're a Xbox Gold Pass member or Game Pass member or a uh, you pre-order the Ultimate Edition of the game, you get early access to the game. It doesn't technically come out until September 10th, but because I am a, a Game Pass member, I will actually get access to it on Thursday night at 9 p.m. I don't think I'm going to be streaming it Thursday night, mainly because that's a uh, that is a work night, and 9 p.m. is typically the time frame that I get off. So that probably won't be going down. What up, Ed? How you doing, man? Got it. <laughs> um, there we go. We're but in business. Friday. Yeah, since I have streams all day, or not all day Friday, uh, but Friday night, <laughs> that night, I'll Good definitely be playing it. Tank. It's just whether okay. Where do we do that? whether or not well, I finish this game, but I think I should be right. good. On it. I'll stay Can't wait for the game, man. Dude, I watched, um, switch the engines to reserve fuel tank. Nice. Um, I watched Game Ranks video that covers you up, or, yeah, I guess, not fills you in i think that's a better term of uh all the changes from four to five and man i am i there's some changes i was not expecting i didn't know that it was going to be as open world as they're saying it's going to be it's going to have an entire map it's going to be more at your pace okay, rather up. than just like a linear story the entire time i think there's a lot of changes that even if i wasn't for some reason trying this i think i'd still actually be uh interested in gears 5 so i'm looking i'm looking forward to it, it a lot actually now we go you do remember we're going straight down into a giant hive of <laughs> yo what up lona I, I how you doing man my excitement hold up it's open world it. yeah dude it is straight up open world go watch dude you gotta watch it Honestly, I feel like I should watch it on stream. Should I watch it on stream? Or should I just continue yeah, with this? You had me at defensible. Now I'm pre-ordering it. Should I watch it? Should we watch it together? It's a great video. It's only like 10 minutes long. But if not, then I sh I'll just continue. Do it? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do it. We'll do it. All right, so real quick. And this is going to be in the YouTube footage too. So that it is what it is. Um, let me pull it up. So here's all the changes in my commentary on Gears 5. Um, five changes. Okay, it doesn't want to come up. Go to game ranks. Um, it's sucking pretty good though. I can't wait, man. Is it? what yo it got taken down i think it's not there what 
I'm pretty sure it got taken down. Did they... Either they took it down and uploaded it too early, or... I don't know, or it got copy striked. Huh. Yeah, it's, it's actually not there. I, wa I literally watched it last night. The Hunt Showdown, Cyberpunk, Weird Gaming Stories. And, yeah. I guess it got taken down. It was Gears of, World, uh, Gears of War 5, but it was all the changes from 4 to 5. And they showed footage of open world. They showed footage of the horde mode. Um, the, the characters that you'll be able to play as, um, who else? Uh, the little, there, I can't remember, I think it's Frank or something like that. Uh, you can play as like a support robot in horde mode, which is pretty cool. Um, there's a lot of changes. Uh, there's the vehicle that you can drive around of war. Really taken down? I see Gears of War 4, 10 things you need to know, and Gears of War 4 before you buy. But I guess they took it down. All right, well, um, can't watch that. It was your video or somebody else's? It was uh, Game Ranks. Game Ranks' video, I guess, got... I'm gonna see if my buddy wants to join. He said this the WoW server that he was going to get on is close to four hours queue. A week later, man, and four hours. I need to cancel my membership. Dude, I forgot about that. Oh man. I was excited to show you that video too. Damn. Well, it's, I mean, you'll see, but there's a, there's a lot of, there was, it was actually very informative. Most games, like, I'm pretty up to date with what's going on, but like this game, or Gears 5, like, honestly, it's, it's kind of just a whim of me getting back into this series. So, uh, watching it, it really did inform me about a lot of stuff I otherwise wouldn't have known about. So, that was pretty cool. I'm gonna drop this guy right here. When you in gears. Oh boy. Sorry, those things are going off one time. For the first time because of uh I added two of them today. But then it that should guy, be good for a while. What the hell's going on? Shit! It's those damn tendrils. They're getting caught in the gears. We're being boarded. September is finally here. Let's Half off here to subscribe. Come. On Twitch. Or free with Amazon Prime. Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> I think it's for first time though. I don't know if it applies to anyone that has subscribed to somebody previously. It's so weird that they're partnering with uh, Subway for it too, but whatever. Oh no, more jubies! No, it does. I'm looking at it. Oh really? Sweet. So. Bunch of them over here. Help me. I think I might trying to save a little bit money right now but I think there's a few people that I'm thinking about subscribing to or two once uh next time I'm like watching them right side here they come I don't name available because Amazon is messing with me Oof. I love the the retro answer What? 
he fighting out there? Got it. Oh. oh, no, 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 no. I feel like they're doing more damage than they did last time. Back in your pod. Nice. The leftover. I'm sure that's not the last of them. Then let's lay down more fortifications. Make things as suboptimal for them as possible. Wow. You keep talking like nice, that, nice. might make you a second lieutenant. Oh, really? Turt. Because I'd rather die Take in a fight. that. Hey, the way things are going, you might just get Drop one right here. Uh, the game is like 100 gigs. Hold on one sec. I'm gonna drop this barrier over on the other side. This game is like 100 gigs because I got an ultimate edition before it came out. And good lord. Rip my SSD. <laughs> True. Um, I have, so I'm, I don't know. I'm like torn between whether I wait and see uh, if I want to put it onto my D drive or if I should just do what I'm doing right now and leave it on my uh, external hard drive. I mean, like this right. game, I get some frame drops here and there, especially like when loading missions. But after like a cutscene or the mission actually loads, it's good to go. Like they're on. I don't really have any more issues, so I'm kind of like, uh, do I, like, should I, or should I not? But I'm afraid because I mean, this game's what three years old technically. Um, I'm afraid that because. Gears 5 is going to be a brand new game. It might, you might want to run it on uh, like a regular hard drive or SSD. I could put it on my SSD, but I don't know. I don't really like putting a lot of games onto my SSD. There's only a few that I do. Gonna play a breakpoint beta? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I need to uh, preload that at some point. That's what I meant to do when I got home. <laughs> I forgot though. Oh well. I literally was telling myself to, uh, to do that today. But completely forgot. Took like 15 minutes? Okay. Did you play the, the alpha at all? I don't think I can really talk about the alpha. But I I did play it. Go down. So I saw somebody saying like, "Oh, those of you that like played the alpha won't attention. be excited for the beta yeah, at all." Like but like, I had no issues with the alpha, like, a hat. like at all. Like I don't know what he was talking about. Prelude. I love gigabit internet. Me too. When it works. When it does work, it's nice. When it doesn't work, it's not so nice. Yeah, I played it. Okay. Nice, nice. Yeah, I thought that was, uh, that was a good time. Guess I'll drop this one. Right. Here. One sec. Let me see if he responded. Oh. Uh. Oh, okay. Hey, Never mind. Stopping? So he's not hey, joining. He was on? saying, oh, it's going to take four hours to get back in. He's already, he's currently in. So he was like trying to see what the queue would be is if, if he left. So if he left, came and played with me and then try getting back in. It would take him Shit, until like midnight right. to be able to get back into the game. Oh, no, so in that case, uh, which is okay. I ain't, I ain't just solo it. That's fine with me. Like that? You know what game? <sighs> I, got a I don't know. I don't know if I could stream it a lot. Like I kind of want to play it a little bit more here and there. Uh, Forza Horizon, especially after playing it and grouping up with some people. Doing the seasonals was pretty fun. 
So, I don't know. I'm thinking about maybe incorporating some Forza streams. Maybe like weekends. Ooh. Uh, like Forza Saturdays or like Forza Sundays. Like two hours of playing Forza on the weekends. Doing the seasonal objectives with friends or like random community members. Things like that. That would be pretty cool. I like that idea. Um, one of these days, I don't know if I'm going to be able to this month at the moment. I wanted to do another charity stream sometime, but the way it's going right now, I, I might not be able to. Uh, we'll see. I'll find out in like a week or so if I can or not. My out of ammo? I don't, okay, good. Not. Got him. Got him. Run around of ammo. Man, October 2nd is going to be here so fast. And then Breakpoint is going to be like my game for about like two or weeks, two, three weeks. Fours of Fridays. That's a good idea. I definitely like it. But I feel like there's way too many games that usually like I could play on a Friday night, you know? That's a great idea, but it won't, especially with, uh, working Saturdays right now. Um, like I, if I wanted to do a Forza, it would be like kind of like a, a midday stream, like, oh, like two or 3 PM. Oh, I'm going to stream some Forza. And then I got on and like played some of that. Um, like a few weeks ago, that's actually what, uh, me and some of the guys from rebel would do we somebody would host a, a forza session on saturdays which is pretty cool yep yep yeah the the f's and the f's i love the sound of that forza fridays that is genius but it's just like they're at the same time there's so many i mean like i could do it a friday where like nothing's coming out or like nothing is out but nowadays, so many games drop on Fridays too, that like it would be hard to coordinate every Friday, you know, or like every other Friday. Every other Friday, I guess, wouldn't be too bad. I don't know. I can I can think about it. If I do it, it'll put I'll put it into the uh, the update, you know, like the Force of Fridays in the go live notification. So now what? We need to find the injury. I definitely like that idea though. I've also thought about um it's kind of the same situation. I mean maybe bi-weekly okay, is a good idea, but so, I don't know. The big um, on the walls sometimes I have the I idea of doing like I know hey, somebody else that does it too. Uh, like what's this Wednesday yeah, we where Wednesday nights you play like a, a weird game or like a humble bundle game or, or something like you normally would never now, play but you play it for like two three hours just yeah, giving it a shot it. something different you know specifically uh -oh. like on Wednesdays that. but like that's another one of those things on. where if you do that it's hard to do a game like this um, you know, cause you're all, you're all over the place. Almost every stream, you're you're playing something new. But I mean, that could be your niche, you know, or that could be my niche. Playing like, oh, you, you follow me to to see what games I'm gonna play. Which is, I mean, it's technically what I do right now. I lose so many. I mean, I don't lose, but I don't regain a lot of people 
shift as I jump from game to game. Like some people, they might hop in. Oh, I like that game. They'll stop and say, hey, how you doing? I'll be like, hey, what's good? Like, been a while. And then they'll be like, okay, I'm gonna go back to work or school or whatever it is. And then you don't really see him again for like another two or three months. You know, that's the hardest part when you're when you're a variety starting out variety. It's it's hard to maintain those those same people unless if they really like your personality, which I, I understand. I follow a lot of people too on Twitch, but there's only like two or three people that I actually like religiously watch like every almost every time I'm not streaming. And I can, so. Yeah, it's been doing that too. Yeah, it's definitely one of those harder things to do, but at the end of the day, I stream because I want to, and I stream because I have fun doing it. So I can't, I can't sit here playing the same game every single day and uh, not get tired of it. The way, I'm jumping from all over the place all the time. It's just not how my brain works. I need to always be doing something else, you know. Are we supposed to be? Oh, activate the emergency brake. I'm going. Got it. Uh, good old days when games used to come out on Tuesdays, but now these game companies got ready and started putting out all type, all these special editions. <laughs> or if you're just attractive in general, he goes to you. Yeah, I I think that can be true. Sometimes, sometimes. I don't know, there's some pretty, uh, I mean, what am I, who am I to say, but there's some questionable people that hit the top and whatever. Maybe they, they, they've got a personality, they've got a better personality, that's, that's how they get there. Now is everyone all right? No, I, yeah, you're not showing, throwing shade, it's just what you observed. No, I agree. No, I, I completely get what you're saying. Completely understand. Yeah, I don't, I don't like, like, putting anybody down like that either. But like, I totally get what you mean. That's why, like, I, I don't want to like say names or anything like that. But like, I totally get what you're saying. But it's the same way with actors, you know. Like, there's a lot of actors that get top roles just because, like. One actor is like, extremely physically fit and everything doesn't mean that like that one person who isn't isn't like a good actor, you know. It's the same thing. Music too. You could throw every uh, literally every form of entertainment can be put into that same category. Just some people have better strengths than others, and there's nothing wrong with that. That's cool. All right, kick in the door. Uh, that's a lot of guns. Huh. Yeah, it is. Yeah. They didn't just dump locust bodies. Can I switch here too. this pistol? That's creepy. Let's let's keep moving. Oh, nice. Why would snatchers carry their prey all the way down here? My guess, they're returning home to their hive. Which means there's a whole lot of ugly down there waiting for us. Streaming for fun anyway, so I don't get salty on any of these sorts of things. Numbers don't matter to me. Yeah, I agree. Um, I mean, yeah, everybody wants to grow. Everybody wants to be up there, like, top, like, getting constant people. But if I, I, I'd much rather, like, watching all these high-end streamers, I enjoy them, like, watching. But it's so hard to interact with a lot of them. And the one thing I, I rather would have is instead of, you know, having like 30 people 
and like three three people chatting Guys, um look at this. i'd rather have like five steady Still people chatting too. and Which those people being my five viewers you know something like that so I heard locust shells are indestructible put it this way smash a diamond against those things and those diamond. people like you can actually interact with know, know, talk Chris, with yeah, like you can you're, you're not stuff. really missing a lot of messages like yeah at some points Heads if up, everybody's typing it. at the same time it might be a little um a little much but it's easy to go back it's easy to look look up and see what you missed and then respond you know interaction is like the w number one thing what I, re I really like about streaming and why I dedicate three days a week um, at the moment. Right now, this week is going to be probably four. Um, but I, I dedicate at least three days a week because I, I like it. Even if I'm just sitting here talking to myself for like 45 minutes, you know, it's cool. It's fun. I honestly wish I did it. I think that's all a lot earlier in my life a lot younger well definitely in the right place. i i could never would five years ago three years ago i never would have saw myself Got sitting him. in front of a camera live streaming Guys, to uh crystals over there random people on out. the internet you know, make sure it's not a uh, but you know my one friend started doing it he's a good looking guy he started growing pretty fast not gonna lie he kind of fell off of this been working and things like that he kind of inspired me to do it so i was like you know what i'm gonna try it i'm gonna see how i do and see if i can stick with it and i told myself if i'm gonna do this i'm gonna stick with it like i'm not gonna let things stop me here and there it might be a little bit rough but i'm gonna stick with it and that's what i did Nice. Talking a lot more than you used to. You improved on me. Hey, man, I appreciate it. I feel I'm every single day, man. You just gotta change it up. I stumble on a lot of my own words. You know, I feel like I, I pick up on some of my flaws. I used to sit here. I mean, even now and then, I sit here and I'm kind of just, you know focused on what's going on and then you, you get like that you're playing the game i mean it, it is a little bit hard talking and playing a game at the same time especially looking over reading chat looking back playing the game i mean here i am almost about to die so but i appreciate it that means a lot if you notice something then it's nice to hear that. Uh, man. I got you. Oh, no. Oh. I'm coming. Oh no. I'm finally glad that upload I think uploading uh my videos to YouTube is gonna be uh very I think it's gonna help me in the long run. Even if, if not a lot of people are watching right, right now, just... um, I think oh, having that archive Let's there that of episodes of video games that I play, now I'm not worried about what I play. Even though if I don't get, like, of course, numbers don't mean everything. But I do sometimes take into consideration what I'm playing because, I mean, yeah, I could be the only person streaming it. But that doesn't necessarily any mean that anybody's going to be able to find me. Like, I've been wanting to play Firewatch, Stanley Parable, um, a few other games for a long time. But not only is time constrict, but also sometimes I take into consideration, okay, what is, what's popular right now? What am I having fun playing? What would I like to try that could potentially help me? Something that I'll enjoy, but then also could help me grow. Game like this, I feel like.